T-Bird, how can I make my designs better? How can I make my designs faster? Why would I put all my time and effort in creating a design and I don't even know if it's going to sell? I listen to the community. I listen to the comments. Everybody, let's just take a deep breath. And let's just kittle. Okay, everybody. So we are on Kittle, Kittle.com. And Kittle is a website that I have been using for almost two weeks. I have created a little bit over 20 designs and two of those designs are getting fulfilled right now because they have sold, okay? So Kittle is gonna save you a lot of time. It's gonna save you a lot of uh, effort and money when it comes to creating your logos, um, designs for shirts, print on demand, and things like that. So. A little bit of things that Kittle has to offer, a couple of things that Kittle has to offer is they have this AI power design tools and mockups, which is what I use a lot. The advanced text editing, which is what I, uh, when I first started out using Kittle, this is what really, I was like, okay, this is what I, this is what I like right here. I like this right here. Um, they have recoloring and they have ready to use templates. Now the ready to use templates are like grade A, A1 templates. It's, it kind of feels like that teacher that you like that's helping you with your homework or you know helping you in class like that's what the ready to use templates feel like it's, it's that type of vibe it's that a one all right so um without further ado let's go ahead and create us a project because we're actually going to create us a uh, winning design right now okay so let's go over here a new project now once you click on project as you see they're going to have different type of standard presets you have uh, the postcard, poster card you have even for your social media posts, Instagram and Facebook. You also have um, print on demand uh, presets. So you have your uh, t-shirts and you have your print on demand providers, Redbubble, Printful, uh, Printify, the, you know, the very popular ones. So let's go ahead and we're just going to start off with a standard. Uh, let's change the DPI to 300. And we're gonna go ahead and create us a design. So let's just say we want, let's say we, let's just say we have a business with, I don't know, um, a service that delivers dog treats or something like that. So first thing that I would do if uh, I would come over to over here, we could go to templates, but we don't go right here where it says text. And let's just choose us a vintage type of text right here. I really like simplicity. So vintage type of um, text uh, is like perfect for me. That's really up my alley. I've learned over the years that simple designs, keeping it just plain and simple, black and white, making it look professional sales. Okay. So these are small little edits that they already have um, placed before us. So we could, uh, with Blacksmith, we can change this to We'll just say doggy eats. So just like Uber eats, we're gonna say doggy eats, okay? And we're gonna change this to let's just say what can we we can say um first of all let's make it a little smaller and you can edit over here off to the side the um different transformations as you can see this um uh, was arch but you can have rise wave flag angle we're gonna get into all that um, but let's change the font size right here. So let's just say 250. I want this a little smaller. So just say 250. And we're going to change that to we fetch. Does that make sense? Dog eats we fetch. We're going to change this to we fetch for you. There we go, doggy eats. Okay, so let's go ahead. Let's just grab us a element now. And they're gonna have different elements that you can choose from. Um, you'll have to go to go try to find you some clip art or anything from the website. Kittle already comes with many, many elements that you can just kind of search up. So let's just look at, let's just say, maybe you want a dog bone or maybe we just wanted a picture of a dog. So they give us different pictures of, of a dog. Or maybe you wanted a dog bone and should show us pictures some elements of um dog a dog bone as well but let's just say out of all these elements we don't see one that we want well what i like about kiddo is that kiddo has ai to where you can generate an image if you don't see what you like so let's say we wanted a dog bone let's just generate us an image 
So as you can see, Kittles AI has generated an image of a dog bone. Now what we can do is go right over here to AI background removal. And we can remove this background image of the bone and we can have this somewhere placed in our logo. Maybe like off to the side right here. I'm gonna hit Command C to copy and I'm gonna press Command V um, to paste. Maybe we can have the other bone somewhere laid across. Um, uh oh. Come here, bone. There we go. Laid across somewhere like this in our image. But, anyways, um, that's just the advancement of Kittle in his AI features. If you don't see the element, you can always um, create a prompt, get as detailed and spe specific with it as possible so you can generate that image um, for what you don't see. Um, not only that, let's just say you don't don't like this type of uh, text that we use. They also have a logo generator. And as you can see, it's in its uh, beta phase. But even with what we have now, we can just say doggy eats business name. Um, let's say, let's quotation, we fetch for you as subtitle. And let's say we want a dog image in logo. And let's generate that and see where that comes out. And it's already generating us some good logos that we can choose from. From as you can see, doggy eats. Let's just um, have a new project right there. Let's uh, look at that doggy eat. <laughs> doggy eats. We fetch for you, and it has the dog and dog logo in the image. Uh, let's click on this one as well. Look at this. Like, is this? You know, this is amazing. I told you this is like your favorite teacher that's helping you with your homework. I tried to tell you guys this. All of these are great logos and images and it is a logo generator, but you can use these as designs. Like this can be a patch, you know, um, an embroidery patch, which I would love for this to be something like an embroidery patch. Okay. But that just shows you it how fast and how many designs you, you can actually knock out just from using Kittle, which is why I love this website so much, which is the reason why I'm trying to put you guys on game about this website, which is also the reason why I have been knocking out so many different listings on Etsy, okay? Okay, so with that being said, for the ones that are new here that doesn't subscribe to my channel, haven't seen any of my videos, um, I do designs on hats, okay? I, I don't deliver dog treats. So guess what we're about to do? We're about to create us a hat and we're about to use Kittle real fast. And we're gonna create us a design and that design is gonna sell. Okay, so let's go ahead and let's go back to Kittle, to our main page. And let's go ahead and let's look at one of the templates and we're gonna click on logos. But by the way, as you can see, they have so many different uh, templates that you can uh, choose from whatever it is that you want to do so but we're gonna go to logos real quick and as i said in the beginning of the video i like things that are simple because simple simple sales simplicity sales to me okay so what we are going to do first of all take note of all these different templates for all different occasions whether it is t-shirts mugs whatever it is that you need, as you can see, posters, cards, social media, covers, thumbnails, they have it all. But what stands out to me is handwriting because handwriting is something that's always just simple to me. It's always simple and it's easy to edit. I'm not that creative. Um, so that's another reason why I like things to be simple. That's why my designs are simple. So we're gonna choose this one right here this brainer handyman let's just choose this one because i like this font i like how the r is like swooshing under so we're gonna just create us a design for a hat real quick just a simple breast cancer awareness hat and like i said if you are new here um with this 
channel when I am experimenting things, I always use the my SH shop that has the cancer awareness. My dad had Alzheimer's. I have a cousin that has breast cancer and 10% of my proceeds go to those, you know, those, those, those cancers. Okay. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to do create something using this template um, with that in mind. Okay. So using this template, very simple. First thing I noticed is that it has a background on it. So it seems as a texture. Okay. The opacity is 53.9. Let's just bring that down to zero. And let's see what it stay. So D let's just, I like this font. As you can see, you can, if you don't like the font, you can come over here. You can search the font that you do like, or you can scroll until you find a font that you like. But I click on templates where I already like the font and I like the style. So I'm just going to double click this and I'm just going to change this to breast. And as you can see, if I click on this and the transformation of this is, is on angle right here. Okay. I might keep it there. I don't know. I have to continue the process and see how this turns out. So let's go with cancer here. And angle is fine for the time being, but I think I want to change this to wave. I kind of like wave. Let's see what flag looks like. Flag is kind of cool, but I think I like wave. Do I want to change this to wave as well? Hmm. That actually doesn't look bad with both of them being wave. That actually doesn't look bad. Uh, let's change this color. Let's give it some pink. So let me find a good pink. I kind of want it dark, but not nothing too dark. So I think that looks good to me right there. We're going to change cancer color is going to be white. So we got the breast cancer. And also, if you click on the image and I said wave, also you can edit the wave and the different type of transformation that you want. If you hit wave and you just hit edit transform, you can click on these dots and kind of move, you know, how you want each letter or how you want the word to be. So let's just say we want it kind of, let's just say we want our design like that. And we're gonna change, let's get services off, let's get, this off and we're gonna keep handyman, but we're gonna change this to awareness. And we're going to align this in the center. And we're also going to change this color to this pink. Now, when you click on text color, now that we have this pink in here, we can hit the document colors. And so it can be the exact color. I don't have to scroll through the bar and try to, you know, mix and match like as I would with other websites. I just click document color. And now we have that same pink right there on us. Now I do like to add elements to my design. My design is going to be that simple. Wait, while I'm here, let's go ahead and did we do wave? We did wave, right? So yeah, we're going to hit wave with the awareness. My designs don't be that simple. Like I was saying, I do what I would like to go over here and get us an element. Also, I forgot to mention if you already have your design and you, you would like to upload your design, then you can do that as well. Also, they have textures like this image had a texture in the beginning, but since I'm doing hats, I'm pretty sure textures will textures would look really good on um, different logos because the texture goes into into the letters. So certain textures will look good for sure, for sure on different logos. Anyway, okay, so get back to what I was saying. I do like to add elements. Of course, we're going to look for a ribbon now. Okay, so let's just find us a nice ribbon that we can put on this image that could um, fit. I was thinking this one, but I actually think I kind of like this one. This one seems more simple. Go to object color and we're going to change it to that pink. Now let's just pull this down a little bit. Zoom in a little bit on here. And let's just put it right here in this little fold. I think that's a little bit too big. I don't want it to stand out too deep in the image. Okay, now let's zoom out. And that'll be our little our little ribbon for our design okay so now that we have our breast cancer awareness design what we're going to do now we're just going to go over here and hit download and we're going to click remove background 
and we're going to download this as a PDF, but you can download this as PNG, JPEG, SVG as well. Uh, for the download size, you can edit the height and then you can also change the DPI, the DPI of the image. If you are doing PNG, JPEG, make sure that the DPI is gonna be uh, 300. I'm just gonna download this as a PDF. PDF is a vector file, so it's not gonna it's not gonna lose anything, no matter how big or small I scale it. So let's just download this as a PDF, and we are going to upload this to Printful. Okay, so that image has downloaded. Now we're going to upload this on a hat. One of the hats that I like to use is a classic dad hat right here. So let's just go ahead and click on this, and let's see how good this. Kittle's design look on this dad hat. I'm gonna go over here to upload and upload our image. Our image is uploaded, so now we can just hit apply. Let's go ahead and see what this Kittle design looks like on a hat, okay? This is what's gonna make us our money, on, our money. So it's looking kind of blurry, but as the image kind of loads up and it's gonna, you know, it's gonna do its thing, it actually look like the logo that we designed. There it is. There's the logo. Right there is good. And the parts that are gray is telling us that these areas need to be pink, okay? The pink stitching. And there it is right there on a hat. Simple, straight to the point. This hat guaranteed to sell. Let's just kind of look at it from a mock-ups point of view, different size, how the hat will look. Uh, customer, these two images very nice for the breast cancer awareness okay so if you guys i'm actually say this template if you guys don't think that this image will sell trust me um uh, let's go to my orders two orders i told you about the two images i have been using kittle for what almost two weeks and a half february 7th being fulfilled february 8th being fulfilled simple designs using the text from Kittle. Don't think these are hats. Let me show you, let me show you one without giving away too much information. As you can see, uh, kidney cancer awareness using simple text from Kittle. So with that being said, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you guys learned something. Hope you guys go out and try Kittle. This will fix a lot of you guys problems and issues that i've been hearing in the community try kittle out for free if you don't take advantage of the pro plan um, use code tbert you get 50 percent off so do that now ladies and gentlemen go out there and get that money and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace